Last week we spoke to a expectant mother who was badly injured in a pit bull attack. Her injuries were so severe that she was not going to be able to return to work for a long time and she might even lose her child. One of her first questions was, how long will all of this take to resolve? And that's a difficult question to answer because often it depends on variables that are often out of the person's control. One of the main factors affecting how long it takes to settle a case, settle any case, is how bad are the injuries. For someone like her who is severely injured and who may need extended medical treatment, she would be doing herself a disservice to try to even talk about settling with an insurance company before she reaches what they call maximum medical improvement. Another factor that, it, that can uh, significantly affect uh, the length of time it takes to settle an insurance claim is how reasonable is the insurance company. Some insurance companies are more reasonable than other insurance companies. And if you're up against an insurance company that is unreasonable, then it can take a significant amount of time. And as a matter of fact, it will most likely require the filing of a lawsuit, and that can take even longer. Whatever happens in your case, you want to make sure that you have an attorney who is experienced in litigating cases against insurance companies. You want to make sure that you have an attorney who is focused on personal injury and who has a specific experience in the type of case that you're bringing to them. In this case, a dog bite case. And you want to make sure that that lawyer has successfully prosecuted claims against insurance companies. It might not matter as much if the lawyer has the experience but does not have the success. I would urge anyone who has had uh, any type of dog bite to immediately contact a personal injury attorney who has experience in dog bite cases. And we would be more than happy to speak with anyone who has questions about their dog bite.